So my dudes, Valk here, and today I'm going to be talking about my Sal's absolute best friend, Jean. I'm going to be showcasing why I use her with Sal, and basically um, covering her artifacts, showing everything I use on her, because now she's basically all but done. I don't think I'm going to really invest in her too much outside of talent, so as you can see this is already level 8. I'm going to maybe get this crown, I'm definitely getting it to 9, but we'll go from there. She's C0, we're going to go over her attributes real quick. 1800 attack, we're going to go down, 79% crit rate, 144 crit damage, 37.2% healing bonus, 165% energy recharge, this is pretty important, <clears throat> and then 47% animal damage bonus. So then we're going to get into the Primordial Jade Cutter, this is the weapon I have on her, I knew I was going to either run this weapon or a Sacrificial Sword on her to help with the energy recharge. This helps with her crit rate so she can deal damage as well with Shao. Right now she hits around um, 13k per R2 or E and then around 22k per Q. As I get talents on it, as I get a little bit more leveled up, it'll definitely keep growing in damage. So, the only thing I'll probably switch on her is whenever I get better um, Viridus and Viridus pieces, I might swap out Gladiator's Finale for Viridus and Viridus, just so it can deal a little bit more damage, but the Gladiator's helps a bit with healing. This is the circlet I have on her. I'm going to go through these artifacts pretty quickly, and then we're going to go ahead and hit up a domain. I can show you guys how she works while I explain at the same time. So yeah, she has pretty decent artifacts. Nothing amazing, nothing groundbreaking, but good enough for what I wanted to do. Anyways, let's go ahead and head on over to a domain while I can farm pieces for other characters while also explaining what she does. Alright, so now that we're in a domain, I'm going to go ahead and talk about what I use her for, her purpose and everything. She basically is a heal bot for Sal and she also helps generate energy. So you can see her and Sal are basically non-existent on ult. So let's say, for example, my Sal is down bad and he needs some heals. What I would do is I would just burn all three dashes, swap over to her, and look, you can see she basically has ult almost instantly. 2.5 more seconds and I'll be able to get ult, but then I can also go over to the Shao and I can generate energy like this way and she's going to get ult also like that. So there's a lot of ways to do this and you can see they keep generating each other's energy and they work like this as a battery and it just works out pretty good all in all as a whole. Makes it a really, really good combination. As you can see Shao took some damage there. I don't like having damage. Let's go ahead and heal him. And then we can go ahead and ult with Sal and sit inside the little field here and just heal up that way. So yeah, this is basically how the team works. It's just those two mostly carry the team and um, everybody else is kind of just there along for the ride. <laughs> this team doesn't really need any help with anything. It's a very, very good team. I, If you guys have Gene, um, building Gene this way, the main reason I have it built this way is purely for, um, purely to support Sal. Because as you can see, I can get the heal ready here. Now Sal's back to full HP, so Sal can fund his own heal this way. It's very important that Sal's able to do that. Makes him, I can't say self-sufficient because he's relying on a support to be able to do it. But yeah, Sal just, it just enables Sal to just do whatever he wants and not really stress it because I know she has his back whenever it comes to energy recharge and ult and all that. So this is a super short video because my gene doesn't really do anything outside of help Sal a lot. And it makes it really, it takes a lot of the weight off Sal's shoulders to be able to do anything. Anyways guys, hopefully this explains why I use Gene in my team, why I think Gene's one of the better supports for Sal because you, you can set it up like I do. And um, you can make it where Sal can kind of fund his own heal. And it'll be very, very good for just about anybody. Anyways, guys, that's all I got for you today. Thank you all, as always, for watching. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And I'll catch you guys later.